Hey, what's going on, everybody? Blaze here, coming at you with another Naruto Shinobi Collection news update, or leak, or whatever you want to call it. But, um, I might just title it leak, I don't fucking know. But, um, we finally got Birthday Sasuke coming out, thank God. He's probably going to be the last banner before anniversary, so that's going to be actually very exciting. He'll be out tomorrow, too. So, as the recording of this video... Uh, 12 hours from now, it'll be 12 a.m. plus another three. So about 13 hours from now, he should be out. And, um, this is gonna be fucking awesome, man. I have been waiting for this motherfucker forever. I got about 40-some stones. So, um, his banner should be up to the 31st. So hopefully, um, I'll be able to trade for some stones in the shop. And, um, I'll probably end up buying some stones. I haven't bought stones in months in this game, but I'll probably buy it for Sasuke. Just for Sasuke anniversary, I'll probably buy some stones. Sasuke is actually very good, so that's pretty cool too. They also thrown in the EX Sakura on a banner. We have the translations. Shout out to yu gi -Oh! once again for the translations. And we'll go on ahead and uh, tell you guys about that now. But first, let's go over this little news update. Alright, so when Sasuke's birthday banner drops, they're also going to be dropping a... Um, event like normal and this sakura right here is probably going to be the point booster for august because this event ends the 31st so make sure you guys farm up this sakura um they also have a new two new gears for sakura and sasuke when you farm this event so keep that in mind too i'll probably end up maxing and doing sasuke instantly when he comes out so yeah expect that i'll probably um I wish I could probably, if I could pull both, Nar, not naruto but um sakura and sasuke i'll probably throw them on a team together with sage mode naruto and maybe Godly Kakashi, just cause for right now. I haven't pulled that many Konoha units in a minute, so. Uh, or maybe I could just throw Jiraiya on there or something like that. I don't know. I'll figure it out when I uh, get around to it. But also, they'll be having a share campaign going on like they normally do. So uh, retweeting and sharing also gives you a chance to get you 33 stones. So keep that in mind, too. And hopefully the campaign um will deliver us our rewards at um before the banner goes away. So that'd be awesome right there. And uh, here's Sasuke's art and shit right here, too. So that's actually very cool. They finally gave us Origin Sasuke. Thank God. He's my favorite character. You guys know Sasuke is my nigga. So, you know, I had to pull for him. Somebody here, somebody with the animated card art right here. <laughs> yeah, there you go, right there. Somebody animated it for us. That should not be blazing. Yeah, that should not be blazing. Uh. <laughs> I was going over here to uh, the general tab. That way we can see his translations. Boom. Shout out to you, you once again for the translations. Sasuke Uchiha, Light and Flame, Crushing Evil. His leader skill is for three turns. Skill damage plus 150% and a skip immunity for Konoha characters. Skill 1. Deal 50 times the attack damage to all enemies with a high chance to inflict the Genjutsu. Now, dealing 50 times attack damage is pretty good for um, 7 stars because 7 stars naturally have a high attack stat. It's not good for characters with low attack stats like that um, EX Destroyer 6 pass Madara, who's absolute shit. Um, and he'll flip the Genjutsu state. He'll deal an additional attack, dealing 50 times the attack damage while under the Genjutsu state. Always hits. Perfect. Um, skill 2. Own attack and skill damage plus 100% and grant the Genjutsu state. He'll remove negative special states to origin allies, and he'll remove positive special states to destroyer allies. Jesus Christ. Um, destroyer enemies, I mean. My bad. I said allies. Destroyer enemies. Genjutsu mode. Skill damage plus 100%. Ignores 70% defense when attacked by a skill. Recovers 100% chakra and plays self in the action bar. When it says place self in the action bar, I wonder does that mean like he'll place himself first in the action bar? Like he'll move up in the action bar? That may that way he can um attack first. Um, ability one, start the battle with Genjutsu mode for five turns. Yes, yes, yes. Start the battle with that shit activated. Let's go. Uh for five turns, attack defense and speed plus 120%. On top of the other stuff you get. That's perfect. Ability two, he's immune to paralysis and genjutsu. When the HP reaches zero, he'll withstand three attacks. Uh he's immune to genjutsu. So what that means is that origins um Itachi does Genjutsu, I mean, too. I think he does. So Sasuke will be immune to that. Perfect, because that Itachi attacks first on the action bar, so it's actually perfect. Um, HP which is 0, which stand 3 attacks. Ability 3, type of energy, and damage cut plus 50% against white type. That's perfect. And then here's his gears right here. Sasuke's pouch, he'll start the battle with 50% chakra and speed plus 60%. Chakra cost minus 50% for 5 turns. Sasuke's sword. 
He's immune to status effects, chance to dodge skill, and chalk HP recovery plus 20%. So this Sasuke is actually very fucking good. I'm going to get him. I don't give a fuck. I need to get this dude. I just got paid today, too. I actually should go get my check early. That way I can cash that motherfucker now. You know what, y'all? That's a good idea. I'm going to go get this motherfucking check. I'm going to go cash this bitch right now. And then uh, I'll be ready for when he come out. Because if I don't do that, then I got to wake up in early in the morning to get my check. And I'm not trying to do all that shit. Besides, if I do it now, I can go buy food today, too. So it's actually a good-ass idea. Uh, she got It's a new EX Sakura on here, too. So we need to go down here and show you guys what Sakura does for all the people who don't want to know. Because she's actually very good. All right. Come on, nah. Come on, nah. Come on, nah. I think they're talking about where they are uh, asking Yui where he would rate him. And just talking about him and shit, because uh, we're going to be scrolling down to Sakura. They're talking about the Kyoto Studio Animation Fire. Um, Shout out to all those, not shout out to all those people, but, you know, my heart goes out to all those people that um passed in the fire. That sucks. But um, Sakura Haruno's Secret Cherry Blossoms, her leader skill is 5 village HP and skill damage plus 80%. Skill 1, deal 3% plus 50,000 to all enemies. Deal more damage the more HP Sakura has. The max is 20 times for one turn. Own and Shinden allies, speed plus 100%. So Shinden is pretty much just like the last characters. You know, the Hinatas, your Sakuras, your Kakashis, your other Sasuke's, and your Naruto's. Now, because of this um first ability, the skill 1, I um I kind of kind of am guessing i don't know for sure but i'm kind of guessing that we might maybe be getting an origin naruto for anniversary i don't know for 100 percent sure but it kind of makes me think that because we still have anniversary to go through so i feel like at some point we might be getting a um a um god damn it hold on i gotta sneeze <coughs> oh my god i sneeze so bad i'm sorry if you guys heard me sneeze then again i don't really give a shit but um I'm thinking Shinden allies. I think uh origin not or well uh, origin Naruto is gonna be coming out from Shinden the last, and um we could throw him on a team too if we pull this uh Sasuke and Sakura. So that'll be actually very good. There's other Shinden characters in the game, but they've very they've become very outdated. The only one who's still any any relevant is the um other uh, Shinden Sasuke. But since this Sasuke is out, who cares about that one? All right, skill two: recover all allies' HP by five hundred thousand, and Chakra by a large amount. He'll grant the bond state. In the bond state, skill damage plus one hundred percent, cast speed plus one. Chakra cost reduced depending on how many allies with the bond state are alive. The max is one hundred percent. Ability one: damage cut plus seventy five percent against origin. Jesus Christ, is she the EX doing that kind of shit? What the fuck is wrong with her? Should be great for PVP just because of that. <laughs> You know how many little origin units are running around? Shit like Sage Bowl, Naruto, the um the Itachi, the Kakashi, this Sasuke is probably gonna be running around PvP now. She does damage cut against them assholes. And then her third ability allows her to do even more damage cuts. So she'll completely clap Itachi. Like she'll do stupid damage to Itachi. Because he's an origin unit and he's the red type. So she'll do crazy fucking damage to that douchebag. Jesus Christ. Um Ability 2, when HP reaches 0, she'll withstand an attack. After withstanding an attack, high chance to dodge kills. Okay, so she'll start dodging like crazy. Jesus Christ. That's scary. And her gears are photo stand. Tight jutsu skill damage plus 120%. Cast speed plus 1. And for 3 turns, strike cost is set to 0. So this is fucking a really good Sakura to use. If I pull this motherfucker, ooh wee. I'm going to be happy to get her. I need this Sakura and this Sasuke. I probably need both. I need to go ahead and just summon on this banner and just try to clean the house and get both these units. And then after that, they're just talking about the uh, units. Like I said, I think uh, Sasuke is going, not Sasuke, but uh, Naruto is probably going to be the anniversary unit. And he's probably going to be a uh, Shinden unit. That way we could um, have like kind of a whole Shinden team right there. And then um, they might even, you probably could still just throw Kakashi on there too. Oh my God, you could do that. Oh my God, Origin Kakashi. Holy shit, holy shit. I forgot about Origin Kakashi. He makes Team 7 act first, and he protects them, and he fucking um, does some other bunch of shit. Oh, my God. So, if somebody has this um, Origin Kakashi, does Naruto that might come out for anniversary, hypothetically, the Sasuke and the Sakura, that's a disgusting fucking team. Oh, my gosh. I just thought about that shit. They need to bring that Kakashi back. They need to bring him back, man. I need to summon for this dude. I didn't know how good he was until after I started fighting him in PvP.
They need to bring him back. I can run that whole team in PvP and destroy. And then um, when shit starts getting cancerous, I can kind of just take um, my uh, Sasuke, my uh, God Slayer Sasuke, and then call it a day on that. So uh, that'll be pretty cool right there. Uh, I'm trying to show, find a picture of Sakura, but I don't think anybody really gives a fuck what she looks like. It's Sakura from the last, and she's kind of got her back turned, with her hands behind her back, kind of leaning over. I guess to you, you're talking about some desert hint of while we're replacing Sasuke on the tier list S, triple S. Jesus Christ. He had, I added a rule for SSS. Oh my God. Only one character can be in it. <laughs> you, you're crazy, man. You, you're crazy. Oh my God. I'm so dead. Look at this motherfucker say, I own Origin Kakashi. Jesus Christ, that is going to be a disgusting team. Oh my goodness. I hope Origin Kakashi's on the banner. If he's on the banner, if I pull this dude, I'll be happy. Pull him and Sasuke and Sakura, you know you pull good on that banner. If you get the, if they on that banner, oh my gosh. And I think that's it right there. I don't think the I don't think anybody threw like a picture of Sakura up in the news update. I could try to look again. I think mostly, yeah. Well, you kind of see it right here. Hold on. God damn it. I scroll past it. Where is it at? Right here next to the Sasuke. You kind of see it. That's pretty much the art looks like right there. And she's blue typing. So, yeah. Keep that in mind right there. But uh, that's going to be it for this video right here, guys. Very hyped. Very hyped that uh, my man Sasuke is finally coming out. I've been talking shit about this dude for weeks now. So, he's finally coming out in the game. So, shout out to the game. Thank you, Shinobi Collection, for finally doing something right. That Asher banner is absolute shit. I'm glad I've been telling you guys to save your stones because if you guys, guys have been saving your stones, you should have enough to start pulling on this and hopefully even pull the unit. But uh, that's going to be it for this video right here. If you guys like this video, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that bullshit. This is me, boy, Blazehood. Peace out.